What it do boys, welcome back to the channel. So I guess it's completely inappropriate for me not to speak on the fact that Chris Bosch is trending on Facebook right now. He's gone on Twitter, posting videos of himself shooting. Seem to be in pretty good shape. He's saying that he's a hooper, that he's ready. Ready to play basketball, looking forward to this season or whatnot. But, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Yes. Did I get excited? Yes. Quick, quickly we forget that Chris Bosh is dominant, dominant offensive player and all around stud. Um, very underrated in my opinion. And people are going to say, how is he underrated? Everybody knows who he is. No. I feel like when they talk about pure talent, he doesn't get looked in that and, and spoken about in that conversation. That's how I feel about Chris Bosh. Like, I think he's very fucking talented. But he doesn't get his... I mean, he's made a shitload of all-star games. He's been on USA teams and all of that. He has plenty of success and obviously people backing him up but i feel like he's never put into that elite conversation and i feel like he's actually there you know he fits in that group maybe not the greatest of course not but he's up there top caliber type player so obviously for the past year and something maybe almost two years already he's been uh dealing with the blood clots maybe my timeline is all fucked up don't don't even worry about that the fact is that he hasn't really been playing basketball. He's not going to be in that same physical shape. So just to see some video of him playing as a Heat fan, it's fucking, it's great. Listen, we haven't, at least me, I really haven't heard much from Chris Bosh in a while. And I follow him on every social media there is. Listen, when Dwayne Wade left, I thought, holy fuck, all we have is Hassan Whiteside. And I honestly felt like Chris Bosh might have... Might have been forced to retire due to all the health issues he's been having. But to see this, this is like that glimpse of hope. You know, just a string of light dangling in front of you. You're hoping to reach out and grab it. Now, all we got to do is just wait for the season to start and see how things play out, man. If Chris Bosh could be healthy the entire season and get us to the playoffs along alongside Whiteside and Dragic, we will make a run in the playoffs. I guarantee it. Even without Dwayne Wade. And it completely sucks because I wish Chris Bosh would have been healthy last year to see what we could have done in the playoffs. Honestly, think about that. We did not have Chris Bosh and we still did pretty good in the playoffs. So my my real concern here is can Chris Bosh be healthy? A full season. We don't have Dwayne Wade and that completely just... I would pick the Bulls over the Heat. I really would. If I had to say Heat versus Bulls, I got to go with the Bulls. And it sucks. But we... With Chris, Chris Bosch being healthy, we're going to have a healthy back and forth competition that I guess makes it more of a toss up than obviously saying, no, Chris Bosch, we are not a contender. But with Chris Bosch, Hassan Whiteside being dominant and Dragic doing his thing, yeah. Remember, Deion Waiters. Everybody's sleeping on Deion Waiters. So, Chris Bosch, man, hopefully everything health wise is on point. Your love for the game, we, we don't even got to question that. We know you're ready. We know that that's not going away. You're hungry, especially now, man. When when players miss so much time away from the game, like I, I've seen Mario Chalmers now. It's been like five months, and he, he said it. You never know what you have until it's gone, and it's true. So Chris Bosch is going to be hungry, ready to prove himself once again, make a name for himself, establish that as he's always done. You know, pe people, people think, Players go out for a year, and I mean, look at Paul George. Look at what he did. So, Chris Bosh, all you got to do is come back, ball out, be healthy, stay healthy. That's your main focus, and just, let's see what we can do in the playoffs. Guys, thanks for watching. It's your boy, Decentric. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. Drop a like if you are a constant, regular subscriber. Guys, I appreciate all the support. I'm checking out NBA 2K17 around the corner. I'm ready. I'm ready. You ready?